Yeah. And just at the end of the show, we've got some local news about the local event happening in November. The oh. Adelaide 500. Yeah. Big some one. New additions. Big one. The Adelaide 500. The Velo Adelaide 500. Um, so first off, started off with the super trucks coming back, um, cool. which is fantastic. Is that-, that is epic and I mean, exclusive to Adelaide mm. and made by Boost Mobile. Like, you know, that he, <laughs> he made the deal come together. <laughs> so, you know, he's, um, I find it really, really fascinating what's going on at the moment over there. And I, I find that he's still supporting motorsports, you know, he's still supporting um, drivers and, you know, even overseas, what he's doing with his other brand as well. I think it's really, really fascinating. Who is he? You don't know? What? what? Who is he? You don't follow him on social media? Right, yeah. I do. We're going to leave Alex over here. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's for the viewers, uh, for the listeners. Oh, Peter Addison for people. I know he is. Okay. Oh, okay. I was going to say. Sorry, gonna say. Um, For the audience. Yvonne and I are being a bit selfish there. We uh... <laughs> No, yeah. So Peter Peter Addison, of course, if you don't know the whole Erebus drama, do check it out. Um, Let's Talk Motorsport. We have covered all of that on our TikTok and YouTube. So be sure to check that out to get some information. If we talk about it now, we're going to be here all night. Yeah, pretty much. Let's Um, let's end up. But yeah, he's Peter is an interesting character. You either love or hate him, but regardless, he's a very passionate man. Yes. And And he's bringing the super trucks back. So go, Peter. We we, we like him. For now. Until he says something else. Unless he says something about us. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> but um, like and, and even if he says something about us shout out thank you yeah thank, appreciate thanks, it thanks for talking about us but uh, yeah no super trucks uh coming back a uh, huge spectacle uh we need it because last year's numbers um for the uh 500 I'm, i don't have accurate numbers but they were lower than the year before mm. that was due to the support categories though I think. Yeah, there wasn't a lot. They weren't yeah. great last year it was this year you know the porsches are back they weren't there last year porsches are back trans am is racing as well. That's cool. Uh, That'd be cool. V8 Utes, obviously. Um, and obviously the Stadium two, Super Trucks. Is, and, of course, Super 2 and Super 3. But potentially one very special one yeah, that I was cool. not expecting. Yeah, no, we're not expecting this one. Sprint cars. Now, they're going to they're, – they're potentially going to be – actually, they're not potentially. They are locked in to race in the LA 500. O- and, off track, not on the actual main No, track. technically – so it's going to be like a little infield. Uh, yeah. In the, in, within the – what would you call it? The infield Precinct. Of, precinct and uh, they're going to be doing races there at night i want to know where they're doing this i can't it's going to of... be cool it's going to be cool i think it's um they're going to be in the track look or in the park it's probably where the motocross stuff is normally maybe what i really mm-hmm. like about all this is that it's turning it into a festival mm. and, and you yeah know, it's not just about the supercars and, and you got the concerts yeah oh, you got sure. cold got... plays playing as well i'm pretty sure well not no. officially announced no, no, uh, no. that's uh maybe they're yeah. playing in melbourne or something okay. Well, yeah, they want there, to there get the money. Yeah. There are rumors, but it's not a Stay tuned enough. for that. <laughs> <laughs> if Coldplay are coming, I'm definitely going. Yeah. But, you know, like it's becoming like a like a festival of motorsport, and that's fantastic. You know, you got your super trucks, you've got, you got your sprint cars, you have all the other major categories that are going to be there. And, I mean, we're still in May. Who knows what else is going to yeah. be announced for it. But what I can tell you is that you can already start to see that the organizers are looking to make a huge comeback. And, yeah, you know, what deserves it? Yeah, it deserves it. It's it's the best, you know. Like it's the you know one of the best uh, um, you know street circuits uh, of of all time, and for sure, and history, uh, history, and and it always produces great racing, and you know, and it is in at the end of the year, it's special. You want to give people reasons, you know, to come to Adelaide, and yeah. for the economy, it's unbelievable what it does. I mean, Adelaide comes alive, and so it's going to be really, really fascinating. Uh, I, I can't wait to. Yeah, we'll be there. We'll be oh, there. Definitely. We'll be sure. covering a lot of things. You'd be we'll, silly if you're not there, to be honest. Yeah. Given literally. how much is going to be on. We'll be there, and you know, hopefully, you know, hopefully, we're there in a in, in a you know in a meaningful way mm-hmm. um, when it comes to the 500. So let's see. Yeah. But before we do that, um, next week we've got a special week or a busy weekend, especially for you, Ivan. Absolutely. Uh, you'll be going to Morgan Park. I am. Well, I am. I will be in Morgan Park. We fly out uh, Thursday, which yep. is really, really um, um, fantastic, you know, to be finally back in the car um, after the high of, of Sydney, of round one, of, you know, finishing in, in the top five. And so I think it's going to be really, really interesting. I've, I've, you know, I've done about a, a million laps uh, on a set of Corsa to familiarize <laughs> myself with the track. Good, good. You know, where do you go when you come out of the pits? <laughs> So it's um looks it's tight it looks bumpy it looks technical um and I think it rewards uh, heavy breakers as well cool 
and I've been working a lot. And when I say working a lot, I, you know, I've been doing a lot of work on the simulator to try and uh, um, get myself ready. I know the weaknesses that were there in Sydney in round one to be with the leading pack. Hopefully we've made some progress and we can start the weekend again, learning a brand new track, but hopefully we can start the weekend on a, on a positive note and get, get the ground, hit the ground running from Friday morning. And, you know, hopefully by Friday afternoon be, you know, there or thereabouts with the pace yep. so that we go into, you know, Saturday qualifying and being competitive. Yeah. So what's your schedule look like for the Formula RX-8? Obviously it's going to be on the high tech oils uh super series yes on ko and sbs which you can catch which races can we watch on We're yeah all, um the official schedule um will be released in a couple of days time um, yeah. we, we don't have it yet here tonight but uh as usual you know the main races will be live i, I believe in the afternoon yeah so i there's think no night time races there's no time no, no, yeah. time racing, no, no unfortunately no. this time but i think from midday till 3 p.m every night every every day yep. from saturday and sunday it will be there so the main feature races will be there uh, qualifying, I believe, will be just on the Facebook pages, so yeah, li yeah. the live stream, cool. and then you have replay on SBS uh, on demand and KO on demand and all that. So yeah, cool. It's um yeah, really looking forward to it. I'm hoping you know to continue the momentum of of Sydney, and you know if we can be once again near the top five, I think we'll be very very happy. Tremendous. Anything above that, and yeah, we might see somebody running around uh, to the airport uh, you know without a new but just just running with his yeah well I, I, I was there firsthand to see your reaction after finishing fifth place i can't imagine if you get even better that was really cool to see actually yeah <laughs> how much passion you had oh yeah and mate, he's into it um I think, that's it yeah look I, I think the passion for me personally the passion comes from how hard it, it works. is to to it get works. to get there and when you finally get that result, you know, you just want to express it because it is difficult. It is hard, you know. Um, the road uh, has not been simple, you know. It's not been Never a, is. Um, you know, it's not been a, you know, 12-year-old that gets into karting and then goes racing and yep. then, you know, it just makes a, a natural transition mm -hmm. into um, uh, other categories. There's been a lot of bumps, but um, I'm here and, um, you know, I'm showing that I, I want it. I want it bad. Yeah, and it even proves that, you know, even if you do a championship, you're not guaranteed to even do the whole thing. Like it's it's difficult. You, week to week, you, things happen, cars fail, and yes, mechanics and oh, sponsors, sure. and it's not easy. And we've seen firsthand with our teammate Leslie that, you know, unfortunately we'll be able to race this weekend, but you know, be back for round three, and you've got to work. You, everyone's working hard Correct. to turn up at the track, and there's travel involved, and obviously this is a Queensland race, and a lot of the teams are from Victoria. Actually, is there even a Queensland driver? Um, I'm not even sure. I think I'm they're all New South sure. Wales I'm and not, Victoria. I'm not. I think but, there might be one or two. Not many. Yeah, everyone's traveling. So like, um, yeah, it's hard work and credit to what you do and hopefully you go well on the weekend. Thank you very much. Hopefully, uh, like I said, practice your roof celebrations. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I mean, hopefully, I mean, I, I hope I can be here next week. And I mean, my flight back home, you know, is around two p.m. So hopefully, I can actually be here with <laughs> got three with, hours with a trophy. You know, like we can actually talk about. Like, it. Yeah, that'll be fantastic. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Carry but, on. But look, I mean, you you have to respect your competitors. Um, you know, like I said, the guys at the front uh, during the Sydney round were spectacular. Um, in their pace, you know, their first lap pace was really 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 fast and so these are all things that i know uh things that hopefully we can work on and um let's see yeah should, should be good so um yeah check out all the action for the tfh hire formula rx8 series which is will be on fox sports and uh, ko or sbs as well so yes, be sure yeah. to tune in for that as well and plus there's many many categories in the high tech or super series so be sure to check that out